Hello. In this video, I will be demonstrating how to terminate an LC angle polish connector. First, turn your machine on. Make sure that your settings are proper. Heat mode needs to be set to LC09. Select and close. Make sure your stripper is set to 900 micron. At this point, prep your left side. First, take your back boot and install it onto your back shell. And install onto your fiber. Place your spring and your heat shrink. Install into your holder. Strip. Clean your fiber. Cleave and install into your splicer. Bring your heat shrink up, place it on your tray. With the LC connector, position is critical to the performance. On the face, one of the hexes, there is a black dot. Black dot is up. That is the proper angle of your connector. Close your lid. Make sure your connector is pushed completely forward. At this point, put it into your automatic thermal stripper. Remove, clean, and cleave. Place in your splicer. Close. Once it's complete, lift your wind cover, let your tensile test run. Once it comes back to your main screen, release your connector. Remove, drop your connector to the bottom, bring your heat shrink up. Open your oven. Placement of this connector is important. You want to be sure to keep the metal part of your connector off of your oven plate. Close. Turn your oven on. It takes about 45 seconds. Once your light goes out, open your oven, remove your connector, put it in your cooling tray, let sit for 10 seconds. At that point, you're ready for final assembly. Bring your spring and back shell all the way up. The spring will come to the back of the hex nut. Make sure that the black dot is positioned up. Remove your dust cap. Inside of your front shell, you will have a cavity that will accept the hex nut of the LC connector. Snap it together, replace your dust cover, your connector is complete. Thank you.